This video is sponsored by JM Go. So I've always wanted a projector TV and there are two reasons why I have never purchased one. The first is they don't really get that bright so you have to use them in the dark or at nighttime. The second is setup is also not very easy typically. You have to aim them head on, you have to correct for distortion it can take a while to set up properly. But with this JM Go N1 Ultra, they really have solved those two main issues. This is one of the brightest and easiest to set up projectors that you can buy, so let's check it out. It comes in a large box. Inside there is a reusable styrofoam carrying case that holds the projector, so if you wanna take it with you to a friend's house, for example, it's easy work. Inside you get the projector, a quick start manual, a regular manual, the remote, and power cable. So let's talk about what makes this projector so good. It's the world's first tricolor laser projector. JMGO has a patent with this system that they call MALC or Microstructure Adaptive Laser Control Triple Laser Machine and what that means is ultimate brightness, color, and contrast. This projector does 2200 CVIA lumens. It projects at 4K resolution with an incredible 1600 to 1 contrast ratio and it outputs 110% of REC 2020 or BT 2020. When you compare that to an LED projector, this trip color laser laser has three times the contrast, 500 to 1 versus 1600 to 1, and the color gamut is twice that of an LED projector. In fact, this projector can display 1.07 billion colors and supports 10-bit color depth, so what you see on screen is color accurate, vivid, like being in your own personal movie theater. In summary, the triple color laser light source means this projector simply outshines competing LED and single laser projectors. And JMGO didn't simply stick a super powerful tri-laser projector in here and clock out. They added a quad-layered diffuser system which results in a brightness uniformity of over 95% across the image. Then they added dynamic light speckle reducer technology or LSR which reduces beam interference speckles by 96%. To add some more cherries on top, this projector produces zero harmful blue light rays, and if you have a friend, a pet, or a child, such as in my case, who walks across the screen mid-movie, it's smart enough to detect that and automatically reduce the brightness of the light source to protect eyes. And again, this works even for pets, which is genius. Gone are the days of walking across and getting blinded by a light. All of this cool tech and fancy projector laser talk simply means that this projector can be used in the daytime. Obviously, Obviously, if you have the sun shining on a wall competing with it, it's not ideal, but in a normal room with a window or two open, it's definitely bright enough to enjoy some movies or TV shows. But when it gets dark, this is where you get the full effect of all of that contrast and excellence in 4K. And as you've been seeing in this video, I purchased a portable projector screen that I can stick anywhere, and with this JMGO N1 Ultra being so compact and requiring just one plug to use, I can create a theater literally anywhere I want. even out outside as long as there is an outlet nearby. The second genius thing about this projector is the integrated gimbal. JMGO says this projector gives you 135 degrees of vertical and 360 degrees of horizontal adjustment, and it does swivel on this built-in stand so you can place it basically anywhere, rotate it, and check this out. You get instant gimbal-like display correction. You can set this up completely improperly and yet somehow magically it corrects the picture and fixes all of the distortion. It's it's awesome to watch. And having this ability to rotate and move up and down means you don't have to find books or borrow a tripod just to set up a projector anymore. You can place it anywhere and it will do the hard work for you. This also means that you can shoot the picture up at your ceiling and watch movies in bed without breaking your neck, which is nice as well. The crazy thing about this is not only is this projector aligning itself properly on a screen, but it's also auto-focusing so that you don't have to go in and manually adjust the focus. Even if you move the projector, let's say five feet back, it will autofocus and make sure that the image on your screen is nice and sharp. You can obviously go into the settings and make some fine tuning adjustments by yourself, but during the time that I've had this thing for the last couple of weeks, I've never once had to go into the settings. This N1 Ultra has two 10 watt speakers built in and they are co created with Dyn Audio. They are adequate, I'd say 90% of scenarios, nice and loud 
loud. So here is a quick audio test using the onboard microphone on my Sony FX30. Very fast lenses. That's at so level 20. Their exceptional low light performance at a very fast aperture and with a name like Nightwalker, what better way to test them than by that taking them 80 percent and recording my wife walking. So let's take a look. They sound great and never left me wanting to connect to additional speakers. Part of that probably has to do with the fact that this projector is very quiet when operating, under 26 decibels of noise. The remote is excellent, the Android TV 11 interface is easy to use and navigate. Really this is a great featured premium projector. I've enjoyed having it around. My son has loved playing a little Minecraft on a 100 inch display. Only on Saturdays though, we gotta keep those video games reined in. Now all of this technology packed into a well built projector does not come cheap. However, if you look at competing options, I think that you get a lot more for your money with a triple laser setup like this than you do with an LED or a single laser projector. And fortunately, because JMGO is sponsoring this video, they wanted to provide a discount code for you guys if you are looking to get one of these under your Christmas tree this year. So I will leave that down in the description below. It ends up being about $700 off USD which is incredible. And if you are on more of a tighter budget, there are several other tiers and less expensive options. This is their top of the line projector, but there are a couple others that are a little bit more budget friendly. So definitely check those out if you're in the market. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for more. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.